Morning, everyone. Um, heading over, like I said, today and yesterday are swapped. Um, Liz and I are going shopping. This will be probably the first, this will be the first time I've seen her since after the wedding as a missus instead of miss. So, yeah. Anyways, um, there's actually something special to talk about today. I won't be partaking in it today as it will most likely be incredibly busy. But we'll talk about that in here in just a couple minutes. All right, as I wait for the car to cool down after taking a listen to the store, blah, 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 blah. Um, yeah, today is Honkin' Huge Burrito Day in Portland. It's a weird, it's a recently voted on holiday because today, 20 years ago, the first food cart opened up in Portland at a place we call Pioneer Courthouse Square. And it's, it's called Portland's Living Room. Um, so basically what it is, it used to be like Shelly's Garden Gourmet, but it was her burritos that got really popular. So she's, it's now Shelly's Honkin' Huge Burrito. Anyways, there's the links below, a link, the link below. And so I was gonna run down there earlier today and get a Honkin' Huge Burrito cause she's only open during weekdays at lunchtime, but I had other stuff to do. Hopefully Aaron and I will be down there tomorrow so that we can get that done. Um, I was started reading an article from New Scientist about skinny protons, shrunken protons, something like that. I'll put a link below so you guys can all read it on yourself. I didn't read too terribly much about it because, like I said, I had stuff to do this morning. <sighs> I feel so fat with that sound backing up. Anyways, so I'm heading home. It's, so what else do we got going on? Skinny protons. Honkin' Huge Burrito Day. And I'll take a picture of it tomorrow during review because I have a place I want to go. Um, and I'll drive down there if I have to. So, it's a place in the Northwest District. It's called Northwest Coffee. That's where I'm going tomorrow. I don't know why people can't use crosswalks around here. Shouldn't be driving while vlogging. I'm not technically looking at the camera. I'm looking at the road. I'm a good boy. So, and cyclists. They don't want to be next to the curb, but they don't want to be in the middle of the road. It's like, uh... So anyways. Got a minivan on my butt back there. That's what you get for some Oregon drivers. They transplant from Washington and think they own the road. Holy hell, I forgot taco shells. Okay, now that I've gone over all the way to Winco, I wound up getting tostada crowns. Basically, it's a tostada shell. However, what I go to Winco for is a pound of pepperoni. So tasty. Lady in the line was like, it's such good pepperoni. I'm like, it tastes like all pepperoni. Flat out, lady, that's what it is. It tastes like all pepperoni. So anyways, yes, I'm heading home now. Gonna go back, deal with the silent treatment of the roommate. I'm not sure why. A girl, I guess. And the reason to see, whoa, you're gay. Yeah, why? Because. <laughs> Women be crazy, yo. I guess that's it for current events. Remember, links below for all the stuff that you've seen or that I've talked about. Um, I might throw another link in there while I'm browsing stuff. Sometimes my Twitter and stuff update. Oh, I forgot. There are two websites that are kind of cool to dink around with or just to look at. Um, one of them is a wind website and another one is a stream follower. Um, if you've ever wondered, like you drop something in a river, like a pine cone, and you're like, oh, drop it in and it floats downstream out of view. Where does it go? Well, pretty much it's gonna get caught in somewhere and not go to its complete destination. But this map allows you to click on any, not any stream, but any pretty much major stream and it'll show the path it takes to get to its end point. Such as like the Great Basin will show any major lake or great the Great Salt Lake. But 
I've clicked on streams that are neighboring in Montana and one goes to the Pacific and like five miles away, another stream will go its long distance all the way to the, the I can't believe I forgot the name of it. Gulf of Mexico. So yeah, dink around with those websites. The one is only good for America. The wind is good for America. Sorry, I live in America. Bye! These sort of bikes are just weird.